Why did we get stopped? Uh, because they're not used to see like only the French license plate on the car. So he was like, why do you have a European plate? And he would be checking the, the papers. He says that he doesn't see much cars without a uh, Canadian plate in the area. Yeah. So we got stopped. Nothing bad. We gave him our international license and French license. And then he talked to us for a bit about what are we doing and how did we end up here how do we bring the car he had he was really intrigued so he said he's just gonna check the paperwork but he says he won't bother us because he's like okay i think this is all legal and pretty cool but i think he's learning as well from, from this experience so it's funny, it's funny. hey this is next meridian we are Nick and Mathilde and left everything behind to travel the world with our Land Rover Defender, Albatros. Three years, seven continents, 88 countries, and just the road as a home. Last week, we spent quite a bit of time in the cities to fix our car. In this week's episode, we are back on the road and drive up north from Toronto to Lake Superior. Our first time in the Great Lakes. First stop was the Bruce Peninsula, a sort of water paradise. It is the Bug Garden of Toronto area and naturally attracts a lot of people. For good reason, it is gorgeous. Come all you young rounders And a story I'll tell promise of heaven and the warning of hell but take heed where you ramble or too soon you will go way up on the hillside where the new flowers grow after two days there we cut the Chimanon, Chim, Chimaun. Anyways, the ferry that is going from Tobermory to Manitoulin Island. There, you get a wilder version of the shore of Lake Huron. We left Toronto a few days ago. We went to the Bruce Peninsula. Um, it was super nice. And now we crossed with the ferry yesterday to Manitoulin Island and look at this view. They'd steal away Where the laughter would flow And the fiddle would play Where well, the folks called it wrong But hell it seemed all wrong in the sun painted picture in the day to night north 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 and then west 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 in all honesty we were in a mentality to go as fast as possible to the rockies at that point up until we reached lake superior and there in front of the beauty of the place we posed there's something different about lake superior so we slowed down a bit for a special event. We are looking for the perfect bivouac spot because tomorrow is my birthday. So we want a nice place for my birthday. Yes! Morning. Um, 
It's Matilda's birthday today, so she's still in bed. And uh, I inflated way more, uh, way more balloons than that. Put a few balloons out here so you can see one here. You can see another one there. Uh, and I put another one you can see over here. And there's some others here. And for each of them, there's like a little, a little pack of something. So let me just show you real quick. So for example, there's a balloon right here. She has to find it. And then for each of the balloons, there's like little, little gifts. So mostly sweets and, uh, and yeah, chocolates and things like that. And, uh, and so now I'm going to wake her up. I'm going to take these balloons, go to the car, put them all over the back of the car and then wait for her to come down. Let's do this. Okay, Pancake, pancakes, mm. and sun, and maple syrup for my birthday. Paddling on the Great Lakes. That's great, right? But you can also walk on the Great Lakes. I bet none of you knew that Jesus was born on the 5th of August. Yeah, getting bites everywhere. Oh wow. This place looks awesome. We should have brought the, brought the fishing rod. We could have eaten even lunch here. We have our own private beach. glass repair sort of like a wax for that little dent we have uh, yep I'm just trying to get my apple on it hello so we got this a uh, windshield repair self repair kit um, you may Notice here, uh, let me try and find it right here, that we got another smack on the windshield. Super unlucky. We fixed it um, 
a month ago we switched it out in um we switched it out in germany <laughs> three weeks later here in uh in, um, in canada we get we get another hit so this one is pretty easy As you can see here all we have to do is put a syringe on the on the on the windscreen here and everything will work out so let's just test it out together this is the first time i'm doing something like that check out you can't see anything the little dent is actually right here but it's gone right it's fixed Bivouac spot for the night and for Matilde's birthday we are making udon noodles with tons of different vegetables and one thing you may have not noticed is the car is full of balloons next meridian expedition uh, cooking experience so now we put the garlic and the ginger together. I have two pans because I don't. I have a lot of vegetables and I don't know if I'll be able to fit everything. So we have garlic, ginger together in coconut oil, and then we're going to put the veggies. Mm. Starts looking really good. That's the result! That result looks so good! Looks sick, yeah? And uh, this little one wants to join us for dinner. Yeah, he was with me all cooking. Wow, this, this looks so good. Bon appétit! Bon appétit! Happy birthday! Happy birthday to me! Yeah! Yeah, look, look, look! Final touch! Gosh, you're a star! Thanks! That's how spicy Nick eats. You remember the original plate? That's what it is now. That's a fly. Look, there's a mosquito here. That corner. Oh, it's gonna be impossible. We just finished dinner and it's kind of the evening ritual. Yeah. Killing Canada all the has so many mosquitoes, it's worse than Finland. So every night before bed, kill the mosquitoes. I'm not a mosquito. <laughs> Let's see. Here there's a mosquito. Oh, schlief. We are leaving our camping spots of yesterday without any regrets because it was infested with mosquitoes even this morning there's so many and last night we spent the night killing them one by one every time we thought we were done there would still be some new ones and they were entering the car we don't know how anyways next stop uh i mean we continue alongside lake superior we're going to go to another provincial park but the weather is a bit gloomy today so we might just go for a little walk. National Park. Nice. Greatest lake. One of the biggest lakes out there in the world. No, and look, it, it's the tenth source of surface fresh water. It's yeah. insane. Yeah, it's huge. This is a really cool park. Out of the different parks we've done, or hikes at least. This one is really, really fun. Uh, almost looks like we're somewhere else on the lost island, trying to wait for a boat. 
to show up and like SOS it. Trying to cross the whole way by just touching the wood. Woo! Have you ever played that game when you were a child of uh, touching the floors of lava and you had to jump between the couches and the carpets without touching the floor? Yeah, that's sort of what I'm doing right now. I think we've all played that game, or at least we've known someone that played that game. That increased the rhythm. I touched. I touched. I lost a foot. I lost a foot. Beautiful campsite for tonight and beautiful light as well. So we're just in the middle of a river and we met Damien and Ombrin, two French travelers that are also going down to Patagonia. So we met them on parking I think the other day and now we're going to have dinner together. So we're sitting at the table. I think Faritas tonight on them and we're going to do pancakes tomorrow morning on us. note we said goodbye and thank you to Amrin and Damien and maybe we'll see them again on the road to Ushuaia. Season is advancing and we're ready to go on. We want to arrive in the Rockies in the right season. So it's time to go. We refuel, check the oils, do a few repairs to make sure everything is fine with Albo for the long road waiting for us. Check out the best water station we found so far. It comes out of the ground like this. It's got the water. It's pure and it comes out super fast. Just perfect. Quick level checks before the marathon to the Rockies. And since um, we went to the garage in Montreal, just want to make sure it's good. So if we look at the level, it's actually to the max, almost to the max. So it should be fine. Won't add any. Oh, there we go. But what I've noticed, is the coolant since uh, he had to remove the the liquid from the coolant um, to access the starter i've noticed that the level is a bit lower because he had to re-put it but because we have the heat exchanger 
the coolant then also goes down those pipes and I think that's why there's a little difference. And if I put my finger, I can't even touch anything. So I'm definitely missing some. I think I almost put like, I put half of it. 500 ml was missing. <laughs> it's pretty crazy. Yeah, now we're good. I'm touching it and see the cold level is on the level, on the marker, so we're fine. 500 ml missing, good we checked. Now we want to switch out the spare tire with uh, the tire we had switched it out for. So we fixed this tire, um, which was punctured one evening if you saw. And we got switched it with this one. So now we're gonna switch them back, test out that this one uh, does hold the bars, the pressure. And if it does, then we'll leave this tire on. We don't want this tire to be our spare tire. It would not be a good idea. Nice. Why are you so happy? <laughs> <laughs> you filmed this whole time? Because diesel has been super expensive since we arrived. Diesel was like um, $2.15 in Halifax and $2.20 sometimes. And uh, slowly, slowly each day the price has gone down. And now it's $1.82. So that's really good. And uh, now we're gonna, we're gonna fill it all up. We are refueling because we're heading toward Calgary now. It's going to be a few days of like straight road. There's exactly 21 hours road. We checked on the GPS, but with us and our car, it's going to be slower. So yeah, that's it for this week. We say goodbye to the Great Lakes. Uh, we're a bit nostalgic because it's really nice and we hope we could have spent more time but we'll be back one day and uh, subscribe to the channel like the video if you want to follow along the journey and yeah next time we see each other we might get to the rockies so stay tuned ciao ciao Every time we open the door now, it's still a birthday party! Yes, I'm a child. What's up, big moose? How are you doing? Nice.